Today's video topic is your daily habits create your future. Okay, very important. In this life, right? What you do today affects you tomorrow, good or bad. So this society is known for making everybody have bad habits. Habits that slow or hinder an individual. Okay, this could be addictions to maybe porn, drugs, food, right? All that good shit. Anything that's pleasurable or feels good to the body, right? I want you to understand something. Your daily habits is going to create your future. So if you got too much bad habits, that means you're going to have a low vibrational life. Now, what do I mean by low vibrational life? I mean, your life is not going to be as positive, uplifting, right? Your life is not going to be so abundant. You get what I'm saying? It's just not. It's not going to be a happy, fulfilling life. So it's very important that you form great or good habits so you can have the most positive, uplifting life. Now in this life, when you got too much negative things fucking up your vessel, fucking up your mind, your reality itself is going to be negative. This is the cold truth, right? It's the reason it's called bad habits because you're doing something that's costing your health, maybe your well-being, maybe money. That's why I say about addictions. Like for example, we're gonna talk about an addiction. Porn, right? It's costing your health. It's costing your mental health, right? You are throwing your life away, literally. It's called your life force, right? That's a bad habit that's holding a lot of men in this life. And that one bad habit is going to, going to legitimately keep you here for the rest of your fucking life and you don't even know it because you're jacking off and masturbating. Go get some real pussy. And if you, and if you can't get no real pussy, work on yourself, better yourself, improve yourself. So women can start to gravitate towards you. You out of shape, you ugly, you fat. You gotta work on yourself, G. You motherfuckers think being handsome is gonna cut it. It's not. Being handsome is not gonna cut it. Right? Being handsome is a part of it, but if you ain't in shape, nigga, you ain't got no bod around this hoe, you ain't got no purpose, you ain't financially free, you can't take care of yourself, your priorities fucked up, you can forget about women, G, I don't give a fuck how old you is. Women, bro, they desire men who can protect, provide, etc. So if you can't even protect or provide, it don't matter how good you look, G. Right? It doesn't matter how good you look. You can look cute all day, but if you ain't got that money right for yourself, most importantly, who gives a shit about women? Women are the last thing, G. You are a king, you are a god. You come before any woman in this life. Always know that shit. You a king, you a god, you gotta start holding yourself to that standard, right? You legitimately come before any woman, right? So you have to build your life up. Quit the porn, feel me? Stop. Blazing them J's every day, man. It's not getting you nowhere. It's costing you a lot of money. We all done hit one of these before. How much money did we spend on that shit? Right? Exactly. We spent so much money on that goddamn herd. But none of that money went to something positive. We didn't invest in none of that money. That shit went into straight liabilities instead of assets. This is things we got to start working on, ladies and gentlemen. We got to learn to invest. We gotta learn to save money because in this life, it don't matter how much money you get. If you can't save it, maintain it, and know how to invest it, you're not gonna get anywhere because you don't. your priorities is fucked up. You got these bad habits. That's why I tell y'all, y'all gotta start doing things that's going to make you better mentally, gain discipline. So that way, life can be a lot easier because when you have discipline, you are focused. Your priorities straight. Feel me?
quick pause. But yeah, that's why I tell y'all to get discipline so your priorities can be straight, G. You feel me? If you ain't got no discipline, then your priorities fucked up. You don't know how to save, invest, and use money, G. Because your priorities fucked up. If you don't got no discipline, then you're not going to have good habits, G. That's why I keep telling y'all, y'all got to have discipline, men and women. You got to have some type of discipline. I don't give a fuck if it's sexual discipline. You feel me? If you can control your sexual discipline, then... You can accomplish anything. You can discipline yourself, learn and save, invest. You can get your priorities right. That's why I tell y'all to practice celibacy. Feel me? If you could do that, then everything else will fall in your place naturally. Right? You see how I'm on this hoe every day? Dropping that much, nigga, that's discipline. I don't make no excuses, man. Because I'm a grown-ass man. I don't give a fuck what's going on with me in this life, nigga. I'm a grown-ass man. I got shit I got to do. I know nobody ain't coming to help me or save me. I got to save myself. That's what a real man does. Day in, day out, on the grind. No excuses, nigga. And I'm a living proof and example of that. Yeah, on the grind, on their ass. You feel me? I'm a grown-ass man. So, dude... You got to get disciplined if you want to have good habits. Once you get disciplined, you can form good habits, G. And then this is going to create your future because the good habits means positivity, abundance, love, longevity, right? Prosperity, right? Because you got discipline now. I'm telling you, discipline is the most best thing you can have, men or women. Once you got some type of discipline over yourself, G, it's not going to be hard to form good habits because good habits are good habits bad habits are bad habits it's the reason it's called bad habits when it's a bad habit that means it's hindering you it's holding you back it's slowing you down so you have to cut back and let go of some of these dumbass habits so you can form good habits for the betterment of your life very important video i'm on it so day in day out that's discipline to wake up every day and make sure i no excuses right that's discipline Discipline as a man makes you powerful. Focused men are powerful. If you can get disciplined as a man, you will become focused. Your priorities will be good, right? That's powerful. A man with discipline is powerful. This is something that 99.9% .9 of men in the society are lacking. Discipline. You must have discipline. If you don't have discipline, you're not going to get the focused mindset. You're not going to develop as a man. You are not going to have your priorities straight. You are going to be everywhere in this life. And you're going to continuously go down a negative spiral. Right? Because a man... And fuck that. We're going to say a little boy because a man got discipline. A little boy who does not have discipline is going to continuously form and create bad habits for himself. Right? This is the truth. You got to have discipline, man. You got to have discipline, G. Any type of discipline is good. I just be telling y'all, see more attention because I feel like, I don't feel like I know. If you can control this shit, G, everything else is going to lay out for you. Look at God. Talk that shit, cuz. Yes. If you can control your sexual energy, nigga, you're good. You're controlling the hardest shit and doing the hardest shit on earth. That's discipline, nigga. It's easy to bust that nut. It's hard to hold it in, right? It's pouring ass titties everywhere, right? This is a over-sexualized society. So if you can practice celibacy and go celibate, and, 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 and nigga, you a beast. Bitch, only 1% of us can really do this because we are the gods. We are the divine ones, right? So I'm trying to tell you. Your habits are going to create your future, right? Men, form some type of discipline, G. It don't have to be semen retention or celibacy. I just tell y'all that because that's really what's going on with niggas. You can't control your dick. You can't control your energy. If you can't control your nut, you can't control your energy, nigga. You ain't gonna never be able to control your life, right? That's why I tell y'all to practice. That shit has a lot of health benefits, mental, physical, spiritual benefits, right? You're not doing this shit for no hoe. You're doing this shit for yourself. You're doing this shit for the betterment of your life, for the betterment of your future, so you can get focused out here. Because in this life, as a man, they already want to derail your dumb ass, right? If you can't control yourself, you're going to be controlled by shit outside of you, like negative forces, people, women. Damn, that's why I say, if you can control your sexual energy and not be controlled by women, you fucking beat the game. I beat the game. If you can control your lust as a man, you beat the fucking game, G. Look at God shining on me. You beat the game. What the fuck? Pussy, right? Liabilities, distractions, porn. Those four things I just named hold you back, right? It holds you back as a man in this life, right? Because life is already a big ass distraction. Your whole life, they put you through straight bullshit in school. It's not real. 
You and that bitch gaining no discipline. School don't teach you no damn discipline. They try to act like it's teaching you discipline, but it's too much distractions outside of school, G. Feel me? Got video games, social media now, YouTube, phones. All that shit is not going to help you develop discipline. School don't teach you about no discipline. That shit just pointing this shit to fuck your mind up. Most of that shit is not real knowledge. It's bullshit. I'm telling you the truth. It didn't teach you niggas no discipline. Because if y'all had discipline, y'all would be at the next level in life. But y'all not. Y'all y'all right here. A lot of y'all done finished school, finished high school. But you ain't propelling to the next level because you don't have any real discipline. School ain't teach us no damn discipline. That shit was just designed to make you feel like or make it seem like you got discipline. Or you're gaining discipline. Or you're learning and growing. And you're going to get to the next level after high school. But they lying to you, bro. You got to have discipline. And... It's already hard for you as a man. There's so much distractions out here as a man. Porn is free and shit. Niggas is accessing porn at 13. I know I accessed that shit at 13. Middle school. I accessed that hoe at 13. Beating my life away. Causing so much brain fog. Can't focus in school. So combine me watching porn and I got ADHD. Nigga, I'm in school tripping, wilding. So look, I'm gonna wrap this shit up, man. Your habits are going to create your future. Start forming good habits for the betterment of your life, for the betterment of your future. Because the more you have these bad or negative habits, you are heading down a dark road. Men and women watching this video, them bad habits always trying to get that quick pleasure. I promise you, women, y'all are not exempt from this. Y'all gotta have habits, good habits too, right? Nobody's perfect, but you got more good habits than bad ones, G. Right? <laughs> right? That's all that matters. The goal is to have more good habits than bad habits. If you can maintain and have more good habits in your life, bad habits are not going to overshadow the good habits because good habits are good habits, bad habits are good ha bad habits. So if you can form and have good habits in your life, you will propel to the next level. You will create a or have a better future for yourself so start focusing on having some type of discipline men women watching this video women y'all need some type of discipline too y'all are everywhere completely true gotta have some type of discipline over your purpose some discipline over yourself some type of it okay because you need discipline too ladies and gentlemen so look i'm gonna wrap this shit up man i love you guys so much y'all stay tuned for more content and yeah don't go out gang